For those of you potential riders out there, the one to get your motorcycle license, you have two options. You can take the MSF class, which I highly recommend because generally they'll have a mix of different type of bikes there for you to use. Uh, more importantly, they'll show you how to ride the motorcycle and then of course they'll test you. Uh, which, like I said, I highly recommend you go that route. And that way you can experience a different type of bikes. You can get, they, sometimes they'll have a dual sport cruiser. Uh, they'll have a sport bike. Of course, smaller CC bikes uh, that are very, you know, have uh, mild power because they don't want you to have a fucked up day. But you also have a choice of getting your motorcycle endorsement by taking the driving test. Of course, when you go to the BMV, you have to get a temp. Uh, license first. You have to take a test. You pass that. They give you a temporary license uh, and then you have to come back in a certain period of time and then you can schedule to take a driving test or should I say riding test. But I will tell you they told me that they tried to scare me. They said that 90% of the new riders fail that test and some of them fail it multiple times and I witnessed it myself when I took the test. Of course, I love the challenge, and of course, I did pass the test, but everybody else, there was only one other person that passed. Everybody else failed, and there was one guy there that had took it three times. He came on a Suzuki GSXR 600, I think. He thought he was cool, too cool for school, and he, fa <laughs> he failed for the fourth time while I was there. He should have definitely took the MSF class, but uh, I'm going to tell you why. 90% of the new riders fail, and I'm going to tell you how to pass it. Stay tuned. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. Continually video suggestions, but you may find what you're looking for by visiting my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab my videos and Those are a bunch of playlists with all of my videos categorized in them to make it easier for you to navigate through Absolutely love 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 this bike Three points the riders fail on First one they fail on doing the fast acceleration and then uh, hitting the brakes and swerving Selling, and then hitting the brake and then swerving Let me do it better. and then swerving they have cones of course you have to swerve and miss a cone and you can't put your feet down or drop the bike or you get uh, points deducted and also they have you do a uh, you know a swerve and brake which of course you, you're gonna speed up swerve and then brake real fast before the uh, cone and then the neck and a lot of people fail that and then other people fail when they go around they have cones set up and you have to go slowly around the cones and you can't put a foot down and you can't touch the cone and a lot of people end up putting a foot down I will tell you the number one reason why people fail the cone test is because they come on great big hulking Harley Davidsons. <laughs> you know, they don't come on a lightweight, small little bike. And uh, that's the number one reason why they fail that test. And as far as the brake and swerve, or the you know swerve and brake test, they fail that because they just don't have the skills yet. Like I said, what you need to do if you want to pass that test, get you some cones. Go online, go on YouTube, there's plenty of MSF videos there, there's uh, DMV tests, there's some motor vlogger that's got one where he took the test in his motor vlog, and he shows you exactly what test to take, and just go into a parking lot and set up those cones, uh, just like in the test, and practice before you take the test, and I guarantee you, you will pass that test, 100% guarantee you'll pass the test. Now, if you're the type that are nerd that gets really nervous when you take a test, like sometimes, like how I used to be, I used to be like that, uh, but not anymore. But uh, then you may fail it if you're put on the spot. <laughs> but know that you can retake the test. I think up to like like four times. I told you the one guy failed it like four times. I don't know. Maybe they allow five, 
you may want to call ahead and ask them that but you want to pass it the first time these are skills you should possess that can keep you safe out here on the streets you don't want to be riding around out here on the streets and you're not being able to to break and swerve or swerve and break or, or ride slowly around obstacles because the, the you know when you get out here after a while you are going to uh you're going to have to do an emergency break at some point um there's going to be some cars that's going to test you out here you know take the msf class though don't be a fool man that way you can ride a different type of bikes and have fun with it you know what i'm saying and uh and that way you'll probably get on a dual sport and you may like a dual sport or you may not you may like a cruiser better hey but anyways guys get your butt out there and uh and, and get your motorcycle endorsement whether you take the msf class or take the dmv test whatever just get your license i highly like I said get take the msf class i'll say that over and over and over again and uh get a motorcycle get out here and enjoy yourself on your motorcycle it's an antidepressant the best feeling in the world and then when you get the skills you can work up and get you a yz 450 fx supermoto like i got baby i just want to get my gear like my helmet my neck brace keeping me safe out here my airbag vest that i wear on my my street bikes on my jersey and all my stuff I always include links in the description and comment section of my videos or go to my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab my gear Big thumbs up check out my playlist for new riders and popular videos don't forget to comment and subscribe and check out my other channel, Bug Out Moto, where I customize a van for my motorcycle so I can live in my van with my motorcycle and travel across the country anywhere. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Bug Out Moto.